What is up, YouTube? Um, sorry, it's been a minute. I uh, told some people I would go over some things about my car, so I've had a, people ask me a few questions of how I did this or how I did that. So this is more of a little technical video. Um, so I'm gonna go over that. I took my speakers out, so I have access to everything. So. Uh, Here's the JL shirt. Nostalgic, you know? You know, JL isn't quite on the scene like I would like. When I was growing up, everybody wanted JL. But, uh, all right, let's check this out. Okay. So, one thing I did to this thing, turn my lights on. got LED license plate light yeah they're super nice makes it look way new uh, way more uh, makes it way more newer looking um, I got a uh, you know all my the lights done in the back uh, I still got a factory light that turns on under everything, but I'm changing those out to blue also. And then I got uh, the remote, so you can fade it, and then it changes all the colors. But I usually leave it on the blue. And then I got the underglow. I usually leave that on blue too. I can't mess with it because it's an app on my phone and when I'm recording a video, it doesn't really make sense, but this stuff's held up really nice. It's rained ever since I put them on pretty much and I've had no shorts, nothing. Everything has worked real well. So, been really happy with that. But it's illegal to drive around like this. Luckily, I live in a state where you can drive around with solid colors. Most states don't even let you drive around with blue or red or yellow, like, you know, emergency colors. But I can drive around with the blue or just a white, clean under. So in my trunk, completely empty. Totally all the way empty. Um, this is my lights for the underneath. Goes right here, but I'm going to hardwire them and run a wire up front so I can turn them on and off as I would like because um, everything I do I'm not sure I gotta like look under the car to see what it's doing so one thing I got a LC let me turn on a light for you LC2i right there that's right that's it right there that's my LC2i got it I got everything uh, sound deadened. I guess I should have took these out so I could show everybody, but I got all the trunk sound deadened. There's a couple little flaps. There's one on each side. It's about nine, 10 inches long or something. And I put a couple layers over that. So all that you could see in my trunk is speaker wires. So just toss those out of the way. I got them, uh, I got these uh, banana connectors, so it's easier. It doesn't mess my wire up when I put it in over and over. So I take my box out if I want to do something with my kids. Or and then you lift up the mat, and that's everything. So this is just a piece of deadener with some double-sided tape that I got over top of it. It's a factory piece that I cut out of that. So I just put it over top for some protection. Um, Smart 3K. Um, this is the factory ground in my car right here. So I got a factory ground going right to the battery. So beefed up my factory ground, which probably helps a lot. And then I got a ground wire wrapped all the way around and goes to the second battery. I need to shorten these wires a little bit because this wire could seriously just go from here to there 
make it super short but i didn't want to cut wires and start adding more lugs and heat shrink because i already got all that stuff on um my battery doesn't move i got wood on the sides of it and it's not going to come up because the bottom you know so it, it lays perfectly flat with everything the speaker box on top of it, it it's not moving um that's all the extra wire to my my lights um you know the one in rca because of the stupid tear amps and speaker wire you know new concepts works pretty good then i got the wire for my uh this is a nine conductor wire that goes all the way in here to my lc2i um i got my battery right in the middle for weight distribution um you know like stuff like this they put a battery on this side but then they'll put the jack and all this stuff on this side so i tried to keep it nice and even um i put in blue lights let me turn put in blue lights for my factory uh factory lights which i'm gonna do under these too um let's see there's a light up under here right there so i'm gonna change these to blue also um let me show you what i did for my hole turn on some light so i cut out my hole here there was like a little plastic piece here i was able to take it out whole so i could put it back in when i go to sell the car with no issues and then i used a piece of wire loom and i went all the way around it around the metal so it actually gives it a real solid sorry i'm shaking guys gives it a real like solid look here instead of just some cut metal you know um or i can just go Oop, and it's gone so that's worked out pretty well for me um, somebody was asking me about rim about rims and uh, I'm actually considering putting some rims on it I know I didn't want to at first because I didn't want to mess up the ride on it but that's the only thing I'm missing is some rims here so I might have to do that. Um, this is this is all welding cable, by the way. OFC, straight up copper welding cable. You can hear the fan running in the terrace. There's I got a little wood platform. This is all sound detonator, all over this. This is actually a plastic tub. So I sound deaden the whole plastic tub here all the way around. I got sound deadener. I don't know wires. So yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Uh, I gotta button some things up, shorten some wires up. And then trying to tune it has been really hard because you know I got my box in, I got everything in here and then I can't get to my amp, you know? And then the LC2i is way back in there, so it's hard to tune it. So I know I've got to be clipping and stuff. And my clip thing's broke. So I might have to buy another one of those or something. Um, but yeah. I'm sweating balls, trying to. Well, I got some LEDs up under here too. But I only can plug in one at a time. So yeah, they're right here yeah so i got some leds in the trunk too that's this is the box for the leds it, i just tossed it in here because i'd rather have under lights instead of in there but it makes the little square glow but yeah all right y'all well thanks for watching i hope that you know helps somebody out there but uh i don't know until next time guys peace